Hello and welcome back to another video. Today I'll be taking a look at the uh, re Relight to Reimagined Behaviors. Um, so if you, uh, you know, seen Java mods or are familiar with them, you'll probably be familiar with dynamic lighting. It's basically, um, if you hold a torch in your hand, uh, it'll light up the area around you. Uh, so yeah, let's see, so I think this is pretty much the same thing, so let's jump into it. Yeah, uh, probably gonna need to take the, this off because it gives me night vision so I'm not gonna be able to see the darkness. There we go. So, thank you for downloading Get Real Light to Reimagine It by uh, Tom Hick Tomac Creations. This add on brings light into the world by providing a light when holding or wearing items. The guidebook will share information on what items give light and the custom items you can always craft it with dirt. You can craft it with dirt if you lose it. There's a light item list. All information on the items used for light there. Light levels, uh, what slot you uh, can use them, and in the... Uh, well, uh, that's not very good. So, Beacon gives off a light to level of 15. Yeah, in your main hand. Allowed blocks, Minecraft air, and water. So, let's, uh, let's see the... So, hold on, let me teleport. Teleporter Forest. So if I hold on now, I'm just going to turn the difficulty to peaceful. There we go. Give that to be back. Beacon. So if we go over here, yeah, you can see that the beacon is giving off light. Well, it's in my hand. So if I just exhale the water before I drown, um, and let's go up here. Let's not. Oh, do I have the? Yes, I do. Oh, my cool. There we go. Also, yeah, you can just craft the book with a single block of dirt. So I hold it in my hand, and then, and then you can see it. So, if I give at the light block. Uh, I can't really show this off, but it uses these light blocks. Uh, to uh, get the effect. So this is a light source of 15, so... If I uh, give myself light block underscore 15... So it place, it's basically like placing one of these down in... Do I need to be in creative mode? Two places. Oh, there we go. Ah, yeah, so uh, this will be like removing every uh, 15 light source near me because I'm not holding the beacon, but if I go near it, yeah, I got rid of it. So this will be like, so I don't know, I can't exactly show how, well, actually, if I can find one that works in my off and can does a torch, you know. Uh, but maybe I can find one that works in the off and then I'll be able to show that off. But yeah, the beacon works. Uh, 
Uh, then there's the conduit, which is uh, which only works in water. So we just get the con. Conduit, nothing above water, but if we go down into the water, you see it's uh, giving off a light level. It's actually pretty good. It, ooh, there are there can be a few bugs with it with water, so you can see it's uh, those two blocks of water are struggling to keep up with it. Next up is the the uh, ot Otcher Frog Light. Oh, the Frog Lights. Main Hand, Air, Water, Pleasant Frog Light, and Verdant Frog Light. So if I just go to E and get the Frog. You see that these all produce the same light level, and if I go in the water, then they all still work. Uh, next up on the item list is uh, not the uh, glowstone. Oh my god, what, how many blocks are there? Glowstone, Lantern, Offhand Lantern. Lantern, Main Hand, Offhand. Lava Buckets, Jack of Lanterns, Sea Lanterns, Room Light, Minus uh, hell, Helmet. Campfire, Copper Bulb, Waxed Copper Bulb, End Rods, Torches, uh, Torch light. Offhand torch, glow ink frame, glowstone dust, glow berries, blaze rods, exposed copper bulb, waxed exposed copper bulb, crying obsidian, soul lantern, offhand soul lantern, soul minus helm. Soul Torch, Soul Torch Light, Offhand Soul Torch, Soul Campfire, Glow Ink, Magma Cream, Redstone Ore, Deep Slate Redstone Ore, Weathered Copper Bulb, Waxed Weathered Copper Bulb, Enchanting Enchantment Table, Ender Chest, Glow Lichen, Redstone Torch, Redstone Torch Light, Offhand Redstone Torch, Sea Pickles, Skulk Catalyst, Amethyst Cluster, Large Amethyst Board, Oxi Oxidized Copper Bulb, Waxed ox Oxidized Copper Bulb, Magma Block, Medium Ameth Amethyst, Brewing Standard, Brown Mushroom, Dragon. Why does Brown Mushroom. Oh, yeah, I let at the ice. Yeah, not the black. Yeah, I remember because they use that in the in the sign files in the uh, swamp biome. Anyway, skulk sensor, calibrated skulk sensor, small amethyst board, and that's all the items that produce the light. We have recipes. So uh, red light guidebook description guidebook. Oh yeah, so this is Pat did. Pat had just one of them. Uh, so there's the soul, offhand soul torch, so it's a soul torch, so yeah, it's just a soul torch. Miner's helm is a lantern with a leather cap. Then there's the soul miner's helmet, which is a soul lantern and a leather cap. Uh, then there's the torch light, which is glass and torch. Uh, so if we go torch. Let's take a look at these real quick. So we have the torch and soul torch. We have the redstone torch. We have the torch light, offhand torch, redstone torch light, offhand redstone torch, soul torch light, and soul torch. So yeah, 
it's a truck. Is this is cute? It's just a torch with a block on it. And if we place, oh, that's actually cool. That's cool. It does keep the uh, glass around it when you place it. And if I just quickly set the time to midnight. And then the offhand torch just goes in your offhand. Can you place it down? No, you can't place it down while it's in your offhand. Unfortunately. But now if I hold this, yeah, so it's just a single uh, light block placed at your feet by the looks of it. Yeah, at my feet. And it just, and then it just follows you around to the previous ones get cleared, which is good because, uh, I did a review of the uh, that uh, armors plus plus that had a armor that uh, lit up around lit up an area around you, and that didn't clear these. So it's good that this does clear them because they can cause lag and also be a problem with just like them permanently lighting stuff up. But now if I remove the offhand torch, it goes away. I assume the uh, uh two, Lily. So yeah, this one's uh, uh, got te a 10. And it's just a cute little soul torch with a glass block on top. And I assume redstone's the same. You have redstone torch in your hand and a block redstone. Yep. Yeah. Uh, and that's and the redstone torch is a like, level 7. I uh, should take a look at the Miner's Helm as well while I'm here. Um, right, so you have the Miner's Helm and the Soul Miner's Helm. I'm just going to take a look at the Miner's Helm. So you put it on, it puts a light level of 15 at your head. Oh no, it's still at your feet. I would, I think it would be better if like, this one was at your head. At head level. That would make more sense with it being a helmet. It doesn't work underwater though, surprisingly. I thought it would have worked underwater. Oh well. Uh, recipes, blah, blah, blah. Miner's helm, soul miner's helm, torchlight. Soul torchlight, redstone torchlight, offhand torch, offhand redstone torch, offhand lantern, offhand soul lantern. Yeah, so they be yeah. Uh, uh, clear lights. Uh, replace light blocks. Create really the dynamic light. We uh, save each block. We play to save a performance. We save the list to cursor. Blah blah blah. Yeah. So uh, if you want, you can clear the light in a three by three area in case it bugs out. That's quite uh, cool. There's FAQs. How does the light work? Will this break my will? Will that slash break the light blocks? No. Yep. What are the eliminating? What happens if the light block isn't removed? In case the light block isn't removed in uh, Creative, you can either give yourself a light block and uh, break it or use the clear light blocks button in the menu. Why do I have to be in creative to use the clear line feature? Uh, ideally, we want to lock this behind there being an op. Currently, we cannot check for this. So, until then, we have locked it behind the creative. This is because it can clear light blocks you have placed. Uh, can I give feedback and make suggestions? Yes, we always welcome feedback. Please join us in our Discord. Discord.gg forward slash C. F Z R E H H S J M. So yeah, pretty simple add-on, which is why I never really bothered uh, reviewing it up until now, when I pretty much didn't have many other options, because the, the, the previous uh, add-on drop was bare bones to say the least. So. Uh, it is basically dynamic lighting from a Java mod, which I do believe was a popular uh, mod on Java. So uh, a lot of people probably would like this. Um, 
In my, uh, my only, like, c complaint with this is that, uh, when I light up an area, usually, what I'll do is I'll wait till night time, and it's like, okay, it's dark over here, and I place down a torch, but with this, it's a bit harder to tell, because the light's gonna be constantly following you, so you're gonna have to unequip the torch, find the dark patch, uh, place a torch, yeah, and it just means that you have to switch back and forth between the torch. And it can be a little bit annoying, but it is a cool uh, add-on if you... Uh, well, I would recommend it, uh, just an easier way is like what I've done here. So these torch... So I have a torch and I believe it's like 12 blocks in between. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6... 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Yeah, 12 blocks in between. Because torches give off a light level of, uh, 14, uh, of, uh, basically, they give up, from the center, they get, it goes out six blocks. Uh, and then, well, basically, uh, not to get too complicated, but it, this is basically the most torch efficient way to light up an area. Because uh, this is just like a light level of one right down here in the uh, center of it. Uh, so having the, them like this is the most torch efficient way to light up an area uh, without letting mobs spawn, hostile creatures spawn. Um, so I would, uh, if you're using it, I would just recommend rem memorizing that and then just counting out each. Uh, when you're lighting up stuff up, just counting out each torch you place, or just run, randomly place down the torch every now and then, and hope you don't miss an area of darkness. But yeah, I hope you guys all did enjoy this uh, video. I hope to see you guys uh, in the next uh, video. Oh, <laughs> but yeah, it does seem like this has uh, also. It does seem that like this has been getting updated because it's got the copper bulb and all that. So. That's nice, always nice to see and I don't get updated, but yeah. Um, uh, there's a Discord link down in the description if you want to get in contact uh, with me to like talk about something, like an add-on or something. Uh, or just like post a comment down in the description, uh, in the comment section below. Uh, and I hope to see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.